Welcome to RenewEnergy.com, your renewable energy and sustainability platform. At RenewEnergy.com, we believe in the power of clean, sustainable energy to transform the way we live and work. That's why we offer a range of solutions for businesses and homeowners looking to switch to renewable energy sources such as solar, wind, and water. Hello and welcome to our channel, your go-to source for all things sustainability and clean technology. In today's video, we're drawing a critical comparison between two significant types of hydrogen, green hydrogen and gray hydrogen. We'll delve into their distinct production processes, notable projects worldwide, and why their differences matter to our sustainable future. Hydrogen, a potent energy source, comes in several shades, and today, we're focusing on the two most common, green and gray. The color differentiation corresponds to how each type is produced and its corresponding environmental footprint. Gray hydrogen is currently the most produced type of hydrogen globally, primarily due to its lower cost of production. It's derived via a process known as steam methane reforming, where high temperature steam reacts with natural gas, resulting in hydrogen and carbon dioxide. An example of a large-scale gray hydrogen production facility is the Pernice refinery in the Netherlands, operated by Royal Dutch Shell. Unfortunately, in most cases, the carbon dioxide from this process is released into the atmosphere, escalating the greenhouse gas emissions that drive climate change. On the other hand, we have green hydrogen, the more environmentally friendly alternative. This type of hydrogen is produced through a process called electrolysis, where electricity, ideally from renewable sources like wind or solar power, splits water into hydrogen and oxygen. Since the only byproduct is oxygen, this is considered a sustainable way to produce hydrogen. An excellent example of a green hydrogen project is the Gigastack project in the United Kingdom. The project, led by ITM Power, Ersted, Philips 66 Limited, and Element Energy, aims to produce green hydrogen at scale using offshore wind power. These two types of hydrogen, green and gray, may be identical in their core properties, but the environmental impact of their production processes is significantly different. For instance, consider Australia's ambitious Asian Renewable Energy Hub project. This massive green energy project aims to use wind and solar power to produce green hydrogen for export. Contrast this with traditional gray hydrogen production facilities, such as those in Texas, which use natural gas, and you can start to see how different these processes are. There are challenges, of course, in fully transitioning to green hydrogen. One of the most significant obstacles is the current cost of green hydrogen production, which is higher than that of gray hydrogen due to the costs of renewable energy and electrolysis equipment. However, as technology advances and economies of scale come into play, these costs are expected to fall. Furthermore, creating the infrastructure necessary for a wide-scale green hydrogen economy, such as green hydrogen production facilities, pipelines, and fueling stations, requires considerable investment. Yet, the momentum for green hydrogen is growing. Various parts of the world are harnessing their unique geographic advantages to lead in green hydrogen production. For instance, the Middle East, with its abundant sunshine, is ideal for solar power, while places like Scotland, with strong coastal winds, are perfect for wind power. In conclusion, the difference between green and grey hydrogen is significant. As we navigate the path to our sustainable energy future, understanding these distinctions and making informed choices about our energy sources becomes crucial. We hope this comprehensive comparison, including specific projects and geographic contexts, helped clarify the differences between green and gray hydrogen and why these differences matter for our planet. Remember to subscribe to our channel for more in-depth discussions on sustainability and clean technology. Thanks for watching. Thank you for choosing RenewEnergy.com as your go-to source for all things renewable energy and sustainability. With our YouTube channel, we explore the latest developments and innovations in the field, including hydrogen fuel cells and the use of AI and machine learning to optimize energy consumption. If you're ready to take the next step towards a cleaner, more sustainable future, visit us at RenewEnergy.com and discover the many ways we can help you transition to renewable energy. Thank you for watching and subscribing. Stay up to date on all the latest news and insights by subscribing today.